Okay, guys, <clears throat> I tried to pull myself together as best as I could, especially with me not feeling well. Um, I'm not sure if y'all can see this very well or not, but I did my low bun and I added some hair. Um, I think it turned out right, turned out pretty good. And then I hauled this in, I did a um, try on haul with this. This set came from Burlington and it's a little um, sweater light. Uh, crop top with a um, little sweater, if you will, with a small jacket. We used to wear this back in the day. And then I just have some jeans, which also came from Ross. And then my same white tennis shoes that came from Marshalls. Didn't want to do too much. It's it's not hot. I mean, it's not cold outside, but it's not hot either. It's kind of like that in between weather, and I'm already under the weather, so I didn't want to put on any open toe shoes or anything. Uh, so that's why I have this tennis shoes on. This necklace came from Shein. I had these earrings forever, you guys. I don't know where they came from. Don't remember. But um, yeah, and I did do my mascara. Not sure if you can see it that well. I did my mascara, um, you know, and my little tummy showing a little bit, but it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. So I'm getting ready to fix my breakfast and then I'm going to the doctor, you guys. But I wanted to show you what I was wearing for today. So. This is the OOTD for today. I'm going to try to go. Well, I'll tell y'all when I get in the car. Okay, guys. So, yeah, I am on my way to go to the doctor. Um, I know I have a terrible sinus infection, more than likely. I did take a COVID test, a home COVID test, just to be on the safe side, because you never know. And it was negative, so... I know that um, nine times out of 10, it is a sinus infection. I don't have a fever, but I tell you what, my head feel like somebody is squeezing my head. And um, it's the, you know, it's the sinus pressure. Now what I did do um, last night that helped a lot, uh, cause my daughter, my oldest daughter, one time before I had a lot of congestion and she told me to warm up some water on the stove and then get a towel or something and put over my head and just lean over the hot water the boiling water you know after it boils take it off the stove of course and just breathe in because the um the steam is almost like a um but I think it's called a nutty part a nudie part not a nudie part a, a, a nutty pot I forgot the, the term for it you guys but what it is the the heat the steam of the heat help, will help drain your sinuses so I did that and I was able to breathe a little better and I did felt like it did um, remove some of the pressure because y'all I had to sneeze so many times last night and it just would not come out and I felt so miserable trying to sneeze and couldn't sneeze so whenever I feel it I will fan like right under my nose with my hand to make the sneeze come out and it was so loud and so painful so that did help but I can't have another night like I did last night because my symptoms get worse at night and I just, I, I cannot. So I'm on my way to the doctor now and I call my medical doctor and he's booked, always booked. And I, I gotta find me another doctor cause that doesn't make any sense. I can never get in to see him, you know? So I gotta find another doctor, but right now I'm gonna go to urgent care, one of the urgent care in my city. And then I'm gonna try my best to run some more errands. I wanted to get my nails done, but I don't think that I can tolerate that uh, salon, that nail salon smell, the powder and SNS powder and all that. I don't think I can tolerate that right now with my sinuses. And um, also, I don't think I can keep on a mask for the entire duration of me being there. So. 
yeah, I don't know. But Raya girl will be over later tonight. And um, so you guys will get to see her. We're gonna have movie night tonight and probably um, just order like some pizza or something. Y'all, excuse, if you see some like whiteness on my face, after I put my moisturizer on with the sunscreen, it left like this white um, residue. It usually doesn't do that. I don't know if I put too much on or what. And um, I was gonna put on, well, I was gonna try on my foundation that I got from, I I can't remember the name of it. When I go back home, I'll show it to y'all. I may still try it on. But I just have not been feeling my best, y'all. That's why I really have not been making any videos um, with menopause, which I kind of feel like my body is <clears throat> my body is adjusting because I don't know if it's because of my sinus infection or what. But lately, I've been cold instead of hot. Like last night, I had a little bit of chills, had my robe on and my blanket, and I usually get that way at nights. But again, no fevers. Um, so I don't know um, But it feels more so like a sinus infection because it's just here in my eyes and my head That's why I say it's a sinus infection but um, Yeah, I really have not been feeling my best from the menopausal kind of like had me off balance, you know, and I If I'm not feeling well or up to par actually I did do a video um, some home decor that I purchased which I'm probably not going to upload that because number one I didn't feel my best when I was recording it and you can tell as excuse me as well as I'm not keeping most of the items I'm actually going to try to take it back today so that's why I may not upload that not that I don't come on my channel um, when I mean not saying that I don't come on my channel sometimes when I'm not feeling well, but you know, I don't want my personality or my tone um, to be kind of like sounding depression, sounding depressed or sounding down, you know, try to be uplifting um, when I can. So that's why I haven't been making any videos, but I'm not going to continue to talk because I've already been talking almost six minutes. So. I will see y'all after I come from the doctor. I'll let you know what she said, or he said. Okay, guys, so I am out of the doctors. And of course, is exactly what <laughs> I, um, I diagnosed myself with having a sinus infection. And that's exactly what it was. <laughs> I wish I could write my own prescription, right? But, you know, I don't have that power even though I am a nurse, but nurses can't write prescriptions. Um, and when I finish school, if I finish school, if that's, I don't know, like I say, I'm kind of on the back burner with that, you guys, we'll see. If it's definitely meant for God, if it was from God for me to get my nurse practitioner, then he'll show up and show out and make it a way for it to be paid for because I told him I didn't want any student loan so I got through a year or something with tuition reimbursement from my job but that has already capped out so you know I mean God had that conversation so anyways I say that to say I was going to say even with being a nurse practitioner we still have to have co-signer from the doctor to write prescription so even if I had already finished school I still I guess I could write my own prescription because I have the doctor stamp anyways guys that's neither here nor there but anyways um I have to go pick up my prescription she gave me a prescription of um an antibody I don't know why not when I come on here I act like I can't talk um, she gave me a prescription for an antibiotic, which I knew that's what I was going to get, an antibiotic. Uh, so I'm going to go pick that up, run to my dad's house, and um, I want to, I need to go to Burlington. I mean, I need to go get my son's glasses. I want to go to Burlington. Burlington. I even want to go to Target, but y'all, it's 136 
traffic sometimes starts getting a little crazy but i just wanted to come on yeah y'all see my glasses are still broken i did go to the eye doctor so i'm just waiting for my glasses to come back it takes about maybe two weeks my sunglasses are back because he went like a week before my appointment because I tell you these doctors offices are limited on their appointments and then if they're out of the office you have to wait so but yeah I'm still rocking my little broken glasses and that's why I have the um, shades <laughs> to hold them in place but I like how my hair turned out y'all I have a video coming soon in my channel with how I achieved this um this hairstyle so yeah but yeah see my shades hold up my glasses so that's my little trick but anyways you guys I don't know if you heard me when I said tonight um we're having movie night and baby Raya is coming over so I got to get better so I can play with my little poop poop because the last time she was over my back was hurting and I couldn't really pick her up. And let me tell you, that Raya girl, she like to be picked up, okay? She's two years old and she at like, she don't know what walking is and sitting on her own hiney. She want to sit with you or be in your arms. So we'll have that going on tonight. Um, I'll probably vlog tomorrow too. Y'all actually, oh man, I still got to go up and come around. Should have went the other way. Um, My husband and I, our wedding anniversary is coming up. And I really wanted us to go on the river um, riverboat cruise with dinner here just here locally in my city but I don't know if I'm gonna feel up to it we're supposed to do that tomorrow possibility I'll say do that tomorrow but I don't know y'all we'll see but anyways I am if I do if I don't do that then we're supposed to take baby Raya to the museum I don't know why I call her baby Raya I need to call her baby Raya or Raya girl for some reason but anyways I may still vlog tomorrow. We'll see y'all. But let me go ahead and go pick up my prescription so I can get clear. Because uh, this sinus pressure in my head ain't cute. Okay? It ain't cute at all. And hopefully I have a better night too. But we shall see what else we get into. Um, yeah, I'll bring you guys along. Or whatever I may do. So... Stay tuned. Hey guys, let me know if in your city that you are seeing less and less people wearing masks. Um, <laughs> I went into the UPS store and I was the only one with a mask on. And I've kind of like been seeing that lately. So just drop it in the comment selection below. Comment selection. Just drop it in the comments below and let me know. Are you seeing fewer people with masks on in your city or state? Just wondering. Because I still wear mine. Even though I'm congested, I still wear mine. All right, guys. Here's Raya girl. She won't let me put her down. So I guess she'll do the video with me. Let's show them the rug, Rara. Ra. Uh, the things that I purchased from Ross, I took them back. And these are the things that I got. I think I showed y'all that carpet and um, those baskets, like the ladder room baskets. I took those back. So in the place of that, I purchased two of these rugs. Um, it's by Florence Collection. And the price was $16.99. Um, well, I showed y'all, I did another clip, y'all can see that, $16.99. And then on the back, it has an anti-slip back, and it's um, it has the instructions on the back here, how to care for the carpet. And this is a three by five, three feet by five feet carpet. Take care of them. So that's one. It's real nice. I, I love this. So hopefully it works. 
I bought two because I have a long, it's like my entryway, my foyer entryway, whatever you want to call it. And it seemed like it's extended. So I bought two. So whenever we do the hardware, the hardware, whenever we do the hardwood floors or the vinyl flooring, you getting down, mommy? Whenever we do the, um, either the, either the hardwood or the vinyl flooring, what I plan on doing because, like I said, it's very long. Um, you guys have already seen it, but I'll make sure to you again. Putting another carpet down halfway will probably take away, make it look shorter. Y'all, excuse the noise, my husband outside working or whatever he's doing. So yeah, here's one and then, oh gosh, here's the other one. For the price, $16.99. This is very, very a nice rug. I love the designs because this is my um, this is my um, what you call it? My papa color in my home is blue uh, for right now, and I think when I buy my furniture that I want, it's gonna also be like the creams. I'll say creams blue and if it's gray it's going to be like a light light gray because my walls are like a f f flannel gray i don't know why i say flip flip <laughs> it's like a flannel gray y'all i can't hardly talk i'm so short of breath but yeah that's the carpet and then i think i already showed y'all this little purse thought that was so cute for 13.99 i couldn't resist and then it has the little once you open it up it opens up like a little basket and then here's the chain so that's big enough for me you like you like gg purse you a nasty mouth that's not yours <laughs> look y'all she think it's her right here show show the camera look turn, turn around. around show them the purse they okay. see <laughs> that's gg's thank you so yeah, that's what I bought, and um, yeah, y'all, I'm tired. I think I'm gonna kind of show it. I'm not gonna use it right now, but I'm just gonna make sure that it does fit in the area, and that I like it, and then um, we'll go from there. And I think I'm gonna go take you guys upstairs and try this makeup okay. on my face, because you only have 14 days to decide if you wanna send it back without being charged. Open the door. Open the door for what? You want to go outside? You got no clothes on, mommy. Y'all, she still called me mama. She'll say Gigi when I'm not there, but when she see me, she calls me mama. And she, she knows, who, she knows who her mama is. That's just something she does. She calls everybody mama. Say Gigi. And y'all, I don't know what happened to my other earring. I lost it somewhere. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're going to try that makeup on my face, see if it's a perfect match, skin texture, whatever. And then I'm going to wash my face. And we're supposed to watch movies. We'll see, honey. We're supposed to have pizza. There ain't no pizza here yet. This is, this, this is what I'm talking about, y'all. So this is my front door. Stand by the front door. And then this is how long. This is like my entryway here. But then see how it extends. Really, that's kind of like the family room. But you know what I'm saying. It's like I'm, I'll put one here, and then when the hardwood floors get in, and then like maybe where that la that ladder is, a stand is, or maybe a little yeah, probably right in there is where I want to use the other one because I probably have like a I don't know a seating or something there. And here I want to do like a console table. So yeah, that's my plan. That's why I bought two of those carpets. But now we're gonna see how it fits in this area. So stay tuned. All right, so let's see. I'm gonna move this. Y'all, I'm about to take this blood thing out of my head. This thing heavy. My head already hurt from the sinus pressure. Just gonna move these out the way. And if you're interested in where I got these from, I got these from Home Goods. And I think these were how much these were? I want to say these were $14.99, I think. Good job. I think they were $14.99 a piece. So 
You got milk? Yeah. Let's see. So, let's see y'all. Ooh, I think it's a perfect size. Yep, that is a perfect size. What y'all think? I think it's a perfect size. Yeah. Go get your cup. Okay. okay. I love this. What you think, man? Talking to my daughter, y'all. I suppose it's a, yeah, it's an introvert. <laughs> I'm asking the wrong person, y'all. She don't know a thing about the core, okay? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> she don't know nothing about the core. Oh, yes, I do. Mm. I wanna... Okay. Yeah, I think I like that. Let me give y'all a up-close look. I like the other ones, too, but they just weren't um, wide enough. They were long enough, but not wide enough. So... That's how this one is looking, y'all. Y'all can get a good look at the pattern. What you got? Uh -oh. Oh, oh. So what this is got? how the pattern is looking, y'all. So yeah, I think that's... I love it. That's not yours. Yeah. Yeah, that's God, Mommy. Perfect. Go get your cup. Go get your And I'm gonna cup. move all this stuff right here, like that. And once we get the floors, y'all, excuse me, I guess y'all say, I keep saying this over and over again, but for real, once we get this hardware floor in, then I will we'll start getting my furniture. We are supposed to go look at some, um, some flooring, but I wasn't feeling well. So, but I'm so happy I found that for Ross. All right, y'all. Bye. Put it on there. Square. Where does the square go? Show me where the square goes. <laughs> Can you get it? No, that's rectangle. Show me where the square goes. Hey, you put it in the rectangle. Show me where the square goes. Can I see? Let me see this one. Okay. Raya! Put it on the board, mommy. She was just doing it. Put it on the board. Rectangle. Look, show me where the rectangle goes. I don't know why they made those two the same color. Where does the rectangle go? That's the square. Give me the square. Okay. Put the square on, mommy. No. Mr. Square, Mr. Square. Put Mr. Square on the board. No. <laughs> Mr. Square, Mr. Square, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Mr. Square, Mr. Square, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how, how do, do you do? do? Okay, put the square on there. Here, put the square on there. Here. Where does it go? Where does it go? Where does it go? It is. No. On the board. Put the square on there. Put the square where it goes. Show me. Almost Push got it. it. Put it on there all the way. Good Yay, job. big girl. Rectangle, rectangle, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Rectangle, rectangle, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Hey, put, put the rectangle on. Where are you do? Yeah, where does the rectangle go? Put them on the board. <laughs> Where's it go? 
Where does the rectangle go? Put, put them on the board. On the put it on the right. Okay. Big girl. What is it, baby? What is it? What we got? What we got, mommy? Oh, I did not add bacon to it. <laughs> All right, guys, happy Saturday. I had purchased, yeah, I have my little mini fan on, so if you hear that, that's, hear some noise, it's my mini fan. Um, I told you guys that I had finally ordered the um, foundation from, I, I don't know how you, I, I, Mikey, um, Mikeyage, I don't know, I'm just gonna show y'all the box. I don't know how to pronounce it, but this is how it came packaged. And um, I wanted to see if it's a perfect match because they say it's perfect coverage. This video is not sponsored. I bought this with my own monies. Um, this is how the inside of the box look when you unpackage it. And they have a survey. I'm quite sure you already know. I think it's pronounced Al Maquillage. Il Maquillage. Al Maquillage. Something like that. But anyways, you try the product. 14 days starting on the day they were delivered and y'all I'm probably about seven days in or more I don't know and um but yeah and then if you love it then they'll charge you if you don't love it then you can return it but you have to return it before the 14 days are up and I'm probably over mine um almost close to my being my 14 days being over but this is uh they give you the information how to apply it and everything apply two pumps to your entire face jaw and neckline and then you blend out with a brush or a sponge uh it's a not by hand wait five minutes for foundation to set before checking the shade do not match to your neck or wrist they're a different tone than your face five finish your face with concealer blush and bronzer Wear for a it's a wear for a full week to determine if it's perfect for you. Well, you know, like I said, mine is almost over. Um, I'll tell you guys what shade I got in a minute, but this is how it came packaged. Very nicely packed, uh, packaged, black and white. Love it. And then also I got a free gift. I believe this is an eyeliner yeah it's an eyeliner ink liner rather and it, in the shade black and i like how this came purchased as well y'all don't mind my nails i need to get them done over but i have to wait till i am fully over the sinus infection which i feel much better i went i think i showed you guys i went to the doctor yesterday and got an antibiotic so we're going to see Ooh. And it's falling down. So we're going to see. If this shade actually match. Ooh, my complexion. Try not to tear the box. Just in case I have to return it. If I'm able to. Because. I don't even remember. What date it was sent. But I know it's been a couple of days. Try to take this tape right here off. Let me open it and I'll come back. Okay, guys. So, when you open the box up, your foundation is in here like this. And then you just, well, do they have this one taped down too? Ooh. Hold on, y'all. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, so you just slide it out. And I got this in shade 210. Well, that's what they recommend. They recommend 210. Y'all can see that there, 210. And this is how the bottle looks. Love it. And I believe it's a pump. I've seen so many other people's review on this. Yeah, it comes in a pump. So first thing I want to do it's actually put it on my back of my hand so yeah 
All right, I just applied a little bit to my hand and I'm just gonna check it on my hand. I don't know, that looking kind of, I don't know, let's see. Oh, oh wow. Y'all, guess I should have showed y'all this way. Y'all, look how that blend right into the back of my hand. You can't even tell that I put something on my hand. Wow. You you can't even tell that I put that on the back of my hand. All right. Y'all see the scar? I got that when I went to Bahamas, to the Bahamas. We we're on the beach and I, I feel, I think that was the one. Anyways, I'm going to try to see if it's going to cover. I think I put too much. We're going to see how it looks here. I probably put too much. Oh, I did. Jesus. I didn't mean to put that much on there. Y'all, y'all can't even see. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. You can't even see that mark anymore. Y'all, I know I didn't blend it all the way, but look. My mark totally disappeared. Oh, wow. I'm excited to use this on my face. Okay. I'll be back. Let me get this off my hand and I'll be back. All right, guys. So I'm going to take this. I've already moisturized my face. And I'm just going to put two. Y'all see how my skin look? Before. Let's see. Put two pumps. I just did two pumps and I got my little blender here. So I wanna wet brush a little bit. All right, let's see y'all. Let's see. Anybody ain't putting up. Let me put one in that one. See, that wasn't enough. Let's see two pumps, but that wasn't enough. Okay, let's see. I can tell that it's actually is my color. Y'all, y'all see how this stuff is blending into my melting into my skin. I would say that it definitely matched up my color. Now, is it a full coverage? You know, don't believe it's full coverage. It did cover that scar though on my arm. I guess you just have to use, use more. Y'all see that? I would say it looked like my skin. I would just have to use more to cover up my spots on my face. And it cover my, my spots on my eyes. Yeah, I wish we got color right, y'all. What y'all think? Yeah, but again, like I said, is it really full coverage? No, but it did say also to put your concealer and stuff on too. That's what the direction said, but as far as it not looking like foundation, in my opinion, it doesn't look like foundation and it definitely blend into my skin. And I think it's called the You Wake Up Like This Foundation. I think that's what they advertised. But yeah, I truly think they got the color right, y'all. What y'all think? Does it look like I have on foundation? Or it looks like my skin? 
and it did a good job with covering um, some of my uh, black spots, discoloration, especially under my eyes. It did a pretty good job. But yeah, I just wanted to test it out. I'm just gonna put some mascara on. I'm not doing all that full face, but I am gonna put some mascara on and I'm probably gonna use their, um, use their line right here but I'm not gonna do anything else because I really didn't plan on putting on any makeup. I just needed to hurry up and try this foundation um, to see if I was gonna keep it or not because my time is running out. So I'm just gonna do the rest off camera because this is not a makeup tutorial. I just wanted to test this out with you guys. So, but I can tell you what I plan on doing today. Oh, this is how the eyeliner looks. <laughs> I want to probably go to some good, I'll tell y'all when I get in the car. All right guys, so I just finished my face. I went ahead and put on the rest of the makeup. I can say that that foundation, the company, uh, Al Maquillage, I think that's how you pronounce it. They match my skin complexion perfectly with their, found, with their foundation. And it does look like I woke up like this before I even put the rest of my makeup on. It looked just like my skin. So if y'all haven't tried them out, try them out. No, this video is not sponsored, but I would like to, uh, you know, give props when props are due. This company really matched my skin. So I will be keeping the foundation. Um, I am in the color of 210 by El Maquillage. And um, yeah. Go and do your survey, fill out the survey, and they will definitely match your skin tone perfectly as they did mine. So, yeah, just wanted to say that. I ain't trying to stay up on that wide road, because I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 no. Oh, I can't let them. All right, guys, I am in the car. Oh, I got to show y'all what I was wearing. But anyways, I'll show y'all. Once I get out, get in a store with a mirror, but uh, y'all saw me with this stuff on before, nothing new. I have on my She Is Fearless by Fearless Bell, Dominique Robinson on um, on YouTube and Instagram. I think that's her name. And I just have some Army Fatigue uh, leggings on and some little slides. Um, yeah. I didn't realize it was kind of chilly out here but originally you guys what I was going to do I was going to go to a couple of Goodwills which I still may go and if I do go that will be a separate video um, but I will probably entitle it um, I don't know thrifting at several Goodwills or something like that if I do it it's going to be separate from the blog uh, just wanted to let you guys know what I was going to do but including in this vlog I'm probably going to go to um, maybe home goods and at homes um, at home I'm kind of just looking for like some vases or something because I'm trying to I want to decorate my entryway for spring um, my husband bought my I'm glad I saw that before I got it before I start driving about my um my mirror there but um yeah so i will include that in this vlog not really doing a whole lot i just want to get out really because i've been in the house because i wasn't feeling well uh, i am feeling much better since i have those uh antibodies in my body now feeling better i don't even think i sneeze if i did sneeze yesterday last night maybe once or twice uh, my headache, my sinus headache is kind of going away. And yes, I'm about to put on my glasses again <laughs> with my shades. But y'all, I'm so happy how my makeup turned out. I'm getting better. I may do that too. I may go to Alta. Al Alta. I think it's for nice, pronounced Alta. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, and get like some blush because I really don't have blush. I'm using something that's supposed to go on the lips I believe as my blush and you really can't see it that well anyways um 
but yeah so that's what we're gonna do today and i may grab something to eat to bring back home and yeah that's that's pretty much it it's about 3 44 p.m the temperature in my city is about in the low 70s but it is windy here so it may feel a little breezy i don't have a jacket and i don't even feel like going back upstairs but i don't plan to be out long maybe like an hour or so but anyways i will probably catch you oh i'm probably gonna go back to ross too because what i'm also looking for i'm looking for some um ottomans that's what i'm looking for too specific in color as well maybe like a royal blue or navy blue or either ivory that's kind of like what i'm looking for too so yeah next time i see you guys i will be in one of those stores that i mentioned so let's go <sighs> all right guys i just came out of the first goodwill um i'm looking for specific things like for my entryway and stuff so I did find one thing. You guys can kind of see it in the back. I'll share it more once I get back home. Um, but I met a young lady in the line and she was telling me about another Goodwill that's good to go to. So I'm gonna go to that one and probably that will be it. I was gonna vlog in there y'all, but like I said before, when there's a lot of people, I'm still a little nervous, especially when I'm by myself. You know, I'm a little nervous about <laughs> taking my phone out and um, turning on my camera and recording. I'm, I'm a little better when my kids are with me or, you know, someone other than myself. But when it's just me, yeah, I'm a little, I won't say intimidated, bashful, I guess, because people be looking at me like, okay, why is that girl recording and what's she doing, especially when I have to talk? Oh my gosh, especially when I'm talking y'all and people looking at me like, who is she talking to? You know, cause I, in my city, I really don't find too many vloggers. You know, it's, I know there are like Style by Casanova. We live in the same city. Um, so, but I never, well, I, I bumped and hurt into her a couple of times, but I said all that to say you guys, I didn't vlog in there because it was too many people and like I said I'm, I'm very bashful when it comes down to that but I'm gonna force myself I'm gonna force myself to record in the other Goodwill so I can get some footage but um, I'm happy that I went to this one this one is closer by my home um, because I did find the cat the canvas and um, I'll show you guys well I can go ahead and tell you guys there's a trend. I don't know if the trend is very old or what, but um, I was looking for a large canvas um, artwork to go either in my entryway or my formal dining room, well, formal living room, dining room, whatever you want to call it, or either, um, I think I'm gonna take the street route instead of the highway route. Um, yeah, and y'all, the, the size that I want, let me stop and get me something to eat too. The size of the canvas that I want, y'all, those things can run like $400. I'm like, no, 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 no. So, I just went on YouTube and start searching about, um, I don't know how I found it. I don't know if I just searched DIY canvases or something like that. I think that's what I did. And I saw that a lot of people were using shower curtains to make a large canvas. Some people use shower curtains, some people use a fabric called, I think it's called ta ta tapestry, ta tap tapestry, tapestry. I think that's how you pronounce it, tapestry. Um, let me let these windows up so y'all won't hear all the air blowing. Um, so that's what I did. I went on Amazon and I searched and searched until I found something that I liked. So I found something and I ordered it. So that's why I got this canvas and we're going to see how that turns out. Um, you know, so, but anyways, I'm not going to talk your heads off. I will definitely vlog, whether it's pack or not, people just have to stare at me. I'm going to vlog in this next 
Rich Mahill because Rich Mahill, Lord Jesus, I'm going to vlog in the next Goodwill that I go to, which is in Rich Mahill, which is a good ways from my house. But I'm going to vlog in there, so I'll see y'all when we get there. Crispy chicken, junior pepper chicken. Hi, can I have your um your four for four? Um, I would like the junior bacon cheeseburger. And um, for the drink, let me have a Sprite, please. No salt on the fries. With uh, honey mustard as the sauce. Okay, you said a Sprite and honey mustard? Yes, ma'am. Okay, anything else? And no salt on the fries. Okay. Anything else? No, ma'am, that would be all. 428. Thank you. I'm at Wendy's, y'all to have a little something in my stomach. Gotta use the restroom, but Wendy's is not open. Are you guys still finding that a lot of the restaurants, um, the lobby areas are closed? And I think the Wendy's that is closer to my house, I believe they actually closed down. They said they couldn't they don't have a lot of workers, so people don't want to work. Yeah, they're saying that they, a lot of people don't want to work. And I mean, a lot of these fast food places, they actually went up on on the prices, on the, um, not the prices, but on the, well, the price have gone up too. But uh, minimum wages have gone up. Well, I won't say minimum wages. The um, hourly pay have gone up just to get people to work. Because, yeah. All right, y'all. So we are at. Yeah. Oh, I can't let them take my soul. Nah, 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 See, we was cool right before I hit your fist But he hit the fan when I got him down and pinched But I took a break, I had to leave and go get cleansed God forgive me for all my sins I can't say these cause my last name ain't Kent Cooking on the stove, that's the way he paid the rent Working on the pole, that's the way she pays the wish Better watch your soul, cause you know they trying to get it Yeah, yeah I learned my right from wrong on a song I let my heart bleed on my sleeve through microphones I'm trying to write my wrongs By writing out my wrongs Ran through a check, cause it's hard to live off bread alone So if you see me slipping, yeah, yeah, let me know Cause it ain't the end of times yet, I know, but it's getting close Yeah, I need my space to breathe, that's why I be going ghost I ain't trying to stay up on that wide road Cause I can't let them take my soul Nah, 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 no Oh, I can't let him take my soul Nah, 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 no I can't let him take my soul Nah, 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 no Oh, I can't let him take my soul Nah, 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 no They thinking I'm bluffing But I promise I do it That K got a drum Like murder and booming We sending you verb If I get my little Uzi They thinking I'm crazy I'm gonna see you the haters 
believe what I'm saying, get what I'm painting. A picture big, I call it little baby. If I'm on a the board, then we playing chess. If you on my way, you gon' need a vest. Act big, you might get stretched. All your gun talk, I ain't impressed. My 45 seen real traffic. That's Dallas, Texas. My little partner called a body, four miles of riding. He told him get about the car, hit him with the shotty. That 12th gauge gave him life in the 12th grade. I tried to write him, but we ain't on the same page. Okay guys, I'm back in the car. I guess today is just canvas day for me. <laughs> I found another canvas. I'll show you guys once I get home. Um, at this Goodwill here, they have a upstairs, but she explained to me, um, cause I was like, oh, do you guys have a second floor? Cause I saw some, look like some furniture and stuff was up there, which that's what I was looking for but um she said that i wasn't allowed to go upstairs that was more like for auction um they auction off that stuff and the highest bid or whatever wins but you're not allowed up there and the only way to see it i believe she said you have to go online i don't know she was trying to she was explaining it to me a little bit but i really wasn't listening all that well because she went on and on about other stuff that <laughs> really didn't I didn't need to know, but however, um, I did not find any furniture pieces to like make over to DIY, but I did find another canvas. So right now I'm starting to feel bad, but I'm going to also go to home, um, what the place called at home. And I think that may be the last store I go to. I wanted to go inside the altar to look for some blush and um I don't know if I'm gonna make it in there though because I'm really starting not to feel my best again I was just trying to get out the house to get you know some sun and <laughs> to, like walk around and I did take a COVID test y'all at home COVID test and it was negative. So I don't know. Don't have a fever or anything. I think it's just sad. I do, I feel better far as my congestion, but I am still coughing and um, a little bit in my, I get short of breath <laughs> some and I get tired easily, get fatigued easily. Well, I won't say easily. But I do get fatigued after a while and my head is still hurting so I don't know but anyways I see you guys either at the at home store or altar or child and maybe back at home we shall see y'all all right okay y'all so while I am waiting in Dairy Queen line I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I bought from altar um y'all excuse my broken glasses okay because it's getting dark but um i'm trying to get better at doing makeup and actually let me just take those off i'm trying to get better at makeup and finding the shades and stuff that i really you know that is for my skin um i showed you guys guys earlier the foundation that i got from out Al, 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 i think that's safe for now anyways um i bought this all of the products are elf 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 all of the products are from elf um i bought their this is some blush it's like a it say carabine but it kind of reminds me of like a raspberry color and i want to say this was nine dollars i think and then i bought this putty primer trio yeah i don't know i've just been buying stuff it says use all three for a uh, smooth finish because I do have large pores so I bought this and I think this was nine dollars as well and then I bought this uh, cream contour palette I had this before but not in this color I don't think um, and this was um, I believe this was eight dollars and then I bought their contour brush which I believe was also eight dollars so came to a total of $35 you know hopefully all the colors will work I don't really wear makeup a whole lot but when I do wear it I want it to look nice you know so I'm, I'm in my learning stages and 
I don't wear it a whole lot, but when I do wear it, I want it to look nice. But um, yeah, I'm in Dairy Queen, and I was gonna go to the at-home store. I did go to Home Goods. I didn't see anything in there that I liked, so I didn't even vlog. And um, I also went to, I think that's the only place, the only two places I didn't vlog. So yeah, guys, I was gonna go to the at-home store, but that at home store is so big and I, you really need to have energy to really look and um, I don't have the energy right now so I'm actually going to probably go ahead and close out well when I get home I do want to show y'all that shower curtain that I purchased to make the um, canvas with and I told y'all I was going to pull the, the Goodwill stuff out I'm just going to keep it in because I only went to two Goodwills um so yeah i'm just gonna use it use it for this video for this vlog so when i get home i'll show y'all the shower curtain and fit it with the canvas and stuff that i bought so and then after that i'll close out the vlog so stay tuned y'all all right y'all i'm back home I'm trying to make sure the lighting is okay show y'all <laughs> The canvases that I bought, is that better? I think y'all can still see. Come in that other way. Show y'all the canvases that I bought from Goodwill. Um, I bought this one. This is a 36, what is it? 36 by, be careful, right? Oh, right here. I don't know if somebody built this or what. Stop right Stop right right. <laughs> um, y'all can see right here. Can they see that? Yeah. 36 by 48. And it was only $19.99 from Goodwill. Looks like somebody made this, but I don't know. Um, and this is what's on here. But of course, I'm not going to keep this. I'm going to see how the shower curtain look, can look on top. If you can still see the, if you can't see the colors, then I'm gonna leave it on here. But if you can, I can do two two things. Either I can paint it white, or I can cut it. And then this is the other one that I bought. This one was $4.99, and this is a. This originally came from Kirkland for $29.99. I don't know who in the world paid thirty dollars for this ugly thing. But anyways, um, uh. I don't know what size this one is. This one doesn't tell me what size it is. But anyways, it was $4.99. So, um, Goodwill is a good place for you guys to buy canvases from. You can paint over it or put a shower curtain or do your own painting or whatever. So, can y'all see it? So, yeah. The small one was $4.99, the big one was $19.99, all from Goodwill. And like I said, the small one was 36 by 48. I don't know. I mean, the larger one was 36 by 48. I'm not sure what size the other one was. So, I'm going to show y'all the shower curtain that I bought and put it on top. I'm going to put it back where y'all can see it. Okay. Excuse the noise, y'all. Y'all hear Baby Ryan in the back. As well as my other family. Little girl. That is not no doll, baby. You cannot break my thing. And don't... Don't push over this thing. I bought this shower curtain from Amazon, y'all. Don't knock over my camera. No cheese, nothing. That's not a, uh, give me my thing before you break it. Thank you. No, it's mine. It's mine. I bought this from Amazon. I think it was, how much was this? I want to say it was $19.99, I think. I think that's how much I paid for it. But it is 72 by 72. And it comes with the shower rings too, but of course I'm not using this as a shower curtain. I'm show y'all the pattern. And this is, oh yeah, you will be able to see it. So I'm gonna have to 
I'm gonna have to either get my husband to remove this or either paint over it. I think we're just gonna remove it because I do not feel like painting that. But this is the shower curtain. And it's a 72 by 72. Because I told you guys that my accent color is blue. But um we got some cream, some grays. Oh, that was perfect. Huh? You said it was perfect. Because you know what? On the um, on the website, it looked more like a No, it looks just like that. No, it don't. Yes, it does. Nothing. It's more like a But anyways, this is it, you guys. And you put it, you know, just kind of put it on the shirt. Don't put it on the canvas house. How do you like to look? Oh, wow. You know, but I just kind of want to show you guys. What's that? Oh, they're nice. They got a light on. What are you doing? 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 Kind of like play with this. They wild today. Um, yeah, I think I like this. So just imagine it. And then, um, <laughs> just imagine it being like this. Just imagine it being like this. Yeah, and then excuse them, okay? They just running and <laughs> running and after a while. So yeah, I think I like that. <laughs> they crazy in the rah rah. They crazy. Yeah, they running, running wild, wild. But see now, when I look at them on the camera, it looks more royal blue. But in person, I don't know y'all. But let's see. Let's put this down. Those are one of my pillows. I guess it'll kind of go, because once it's on the wall, you know, but anyways, I just wanted to show that to y'all. Of course, when I actually do the um, project, hold on, all right, guys, I'm going to try, I'm going to try to close out this vlog, even though they're making all that noise. Um, When I do, uh, when I do the DIY project, I'll make sure I actually record it, y'all. And um, I don't know, this is going to be for this wall right here, or if it's going to be for the entryway wall, which is directly across from this wall, or if I'm going to put it further down the uh, wall. So it can kind of like be in between the foyer and the actual beginning of my family room. I don't know, but we'll see, we'll see. And um, you know what I need to see too? Hold on y'all, hold on, before I close it out, hold on, hold on. This might be too much y'all, I don't know. Oh yeah, that's definitely too much. That will not work. <laughs> that will not work. Yeah, 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 yeah. I do like this this shower curtain, but it doesn't match the. Uh, it's not. It's not a good good match with this carpet, especially if I wanted to put it in the entryway, because this this rug is going to be for the entryway. So. Yeah, I think I'm gonna look for another shower curtain. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and close out the vlog. Um, when I do decide to do this DIY, DIY, I'll make sure I do record it. But you can even search DIY shower curtain canvas or something like that, or um, how to make a canvas using a shower curtain, something like that, and you'll see many, many videos on YouTube or people have already done this project so this is not my original idea whatsoever other people have done this as well but um oh god i wish this had matched anyways 
I'm going to find another one. But thank you guys so much for joining me. Hopefully this vlog wasn't all over the place and hopefully it, it was entertaining. <laughs> but until the next time, you guys, y'all be blessed. Make sure you love yourself, stay true to yourself, and be the best you that you can be. And until the next time, you guys, be blessed. All right? Baby Raya, come tell them bye-bye. <laughs> come on. This little girl, she every time you ask her to do something, she goes, oh. Tell them bye. Bye. Give them a kiss. Give them a kiss. No, not me. Give my subscribers a kiss. Do like this. Mwah. Say bye. Bye. Baby girl, you're so fun. I can't get you off my mind. Oh girl, nah, nah. Oh girl.